What's going on, everybody? Your boy, Country Boy. Back again for another Solutions Hard video. And this is Goku TV Raw. If you're new to the channel, like the video, share the video, comment, and subscribe. Now, a young lady owned a hair salon um, and whatnot. You know, she sold weave and everything. She had her own business. Her name was Destiny Harris, 21 years old. And this happened in Baltimore. This happened December 21st. Now, she had um, some trouble out of some Negroes. She had some trouble out of some Negroes, of course. Negroes always cause other black people trouble. Now, she had some trouble out of these nits. Some two, two Negroes uh, came, inside her, came inside of her business, you know, stealing hair. You know, weave that weave bundles that fake weave hair and whatnot. That stuff is very, very expensive. I mean, you know, it's expensive, you know. So basically, was, they held her down, beat her up, and took her weave. Now, keep in mind, people, this girl is 21 years old. Now, either these dudes on the funny side or some. Hair head, weave wearing, jiffy pop bag, black woman, picked these two guys up to this. Had to. Now, of course, you already know, you have a lot of haters. You have a lot of haters within the black community. You know, this girl did everything she's supposed to do. Work hard, be successful in life. And yet, you got this Negro... You got these Negroes in Baltimore. I don't give a fuck who get mad, man. This shit don't make no goddamn sense. You got two Negroes took this young girl life. All solely, I'm sure, I'm sure a female is behind this girl murder. I'm sure. Because not unless these two dudes are gay. Not unless they got some type of sugar in they tank it. In they tank, you know. You know, so... Which I highly doubt it. A female picked these two men up to kill this young girl. You know, because, you know, she by herself. No security. Which well, should have security. She should have had a gun. She should have practiced her second amended rights to carry a gun. Shot the shit out of these two Negroes. And, well, you people probably say, you know, why she called the police? She just made it, she just made it worse on herself. No. That's what the police is there for. But it's obvious that the police is not going to get there in time until you're dead. And then they don't they act like they can't solve people's murders. What good is the police for? Police across all 50 states. What good are they if they can't solve normal crimes? If they can't be there on time, what good are they? We just protect our dang own selves. We just can protect ourselves and practice our second amended rights to be armed and have your gun ready. But anyway, people, on uh, December 20, uh, 26th, they had a, the family members of Destiny had a um, candlelight visual outside the store. And you, can't you believe, people, can't you believe uh, these people... These two Negroes ain't been caught. But I noticed, though, I've been noticed this, but when you a black person, when you successful, when you are successful, when you hang around nothing, nothing as black people who ain't got nothing, they're going to hate on you. They're going to say, oh, that's nothing. Who do you think he is? Or who does she think she is? Your own family member will say the same old thing. If you got more money than them, they're going to hate on you. Your own family member will hate on you. And, and say he, he think he up it because he got this. He think he up it because he got this car. She thinks she this and that because she got her own business. I'm telling you. I'm pretty sure y'all already heard people say this type of stuff before. Black people hate on each other more than anybody. Negroes do not want to see another black person come up. They don't do these to the... They don't do these, do this type of stuff to 
to the Arabs. They don't do this type of stuff to them Asians. Because them, they, they know them Asians are going to kill their ass. They're going to shoot to kill them. The Arabs are going to shoot to kill them. They're going to call the cops and get them out of there quick. You know, or they're going to lock them in their store and, be, and beat them up. You know, see, black folks only act really badass towards other black folks. Black people love killing other black people. We talking about within the United States. We talking about within these other countries, these uh, African countries. We talking about all every, every, all black folks. That's what we talking about because ain't nobody gonna escape this because I know black people, no matter where you at, outside the states or in the United States, black people love killing other black people. These, these are facts, man. These are hardcore facts. And and they let George Zimmerman walk around, but and yet these two Negroes wish to kill a young girl who just mind her business. Now, she filled out the police report and everything. This young girl came back to that uh, British shop. She said she feared for her life. Now, she knew these, uh, these two Negroes and whatnot, that they had a criminal history. You know, she knew this, and so, you know, she feared for her life and whatnot. You know, you got some Negroes that kill you and just for a little chump money, just for a little $100, they'll kill you just for that. Just for $50, $20, they would kill you just to sell that weave just for a quick buck, you know. This innocent young girl life got taken away, taken away. And for what? Now, these these Negroes, these Negroes, they Nipsey hustled her. When I say they Nipsey hustled her, they killed her. Same thing what happened to Nipsey Hustle. Trying to pit a business in the black community. You can't help black people. How many times I got to tell y'all that? You can't help black people get your business out the black community. Go to the white community. Screw these Negroes. I don't give a damn what you people say. I do not care. This is why black people do not set up businesses in the black community. And I see why. Could you blame them? You know, why not set your stuff up, set your business up in the white community instead of the black community? This is the why the black community don't have anything. See, the Negroes, the, the evil Negroes need to be excluded out from the good black people. Things got to change, people. It really has to change. But I know things ain't going to change no matter how much I talk, no matter how much any other YouTubers talk about this. It's, it's like a taboo. It's taboo when, when you want to sit here and talk about all this killing going on in the black community. It's like a taboo. Black people don't want to hear about it. It hurts us. We know about this, but we don't want to talk about it. Shh, 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 shh. Be quiet. It's taboo. We can't talk about black on black crime. We can't talk about black folks harming other black people. It's taboo. We already know what Pook and Rory out here doing. They evil, and they need to be locked up in jail. These evil sons of bitches need to be killed. I don't give a fuck. What nobody said. I, I wish that girl had a gun and shot the both of them. Well, you, some people might say that's wrong. I don't give a fuck what you say. You know, because... It makes sense if you, like, uh, have your own gun, you know, in case, you know, it is like this happen. Stuff like this happen, you know what I mean? So, what you guys think? This is your boy, Country Boy. Like the video, share the video, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next Hardcore Star Lustrous video. And this is Goku TV Raw. Now, my heart goes out to Destiny Harris family. I'm so sorry that this happened. Please, please, please. If y'all ever, ever, ever get another business, move your business to the white community. Forget black people.